when you fire it is like 60%. Let's bring that up a bit higher with a center torso shot. 75, 75, 75, the LRMR for close range. Uh, for Tell me what to shoot. Large laser, medium lasers. That's okay. That did some damage to him. More potential salvage on the field. More potential salvage on the field. Awesome. Behemoth. Commander. Uh, you actually could fire from here. Not a very good hit chance, though. If you move up a bit, like over here, does that change at all? A little bit. Roger. So a little bit of change won't hurt, and yeah, it's a Shadowhawk against Shadowhawk. So yep. I actually critted his short range, and I destroyed one of his jump jets. Reporting critical hit. That looks nice. Some more salvage on the field. Don't be mean and hit the pilot. Oh, yeah, you hit the pilot. Mm. Oh, took a heavy hit there. Of course you did. Why what can you? I do for you? Over here, you would have a decent shot. Decent enough. You betcha. Oh yeah, yeah. That's not the Griffin. That's the other guy. The, the smaller guy. I forgot. Vindicator. All right, torso is gone. Pilot is injured. And Lone Eagle I'm and here. the Blackjack. From here, from the forest. Yeah, decent enough. Do we have... No, we don't have Focus Fire or... Uh, Precision Strike. So just fire in this side. Targeting for an Alpha Strike. Yep, there goes the rest of his center stuff. Pilot is injured again. That hit something good. He's unsteady. And now it's the enemy's turn, more or less. That was an AC something. That actually did hurt. Okay, a bit. that was bad. Yep, it was. So Cosmos, Good to go. uh, you could actually move over here, and then we see what we have over there. On my way. It is a commando, I guess, right? An enforcer. We could fire upon you. That's the only thing we can fire upon. Oh, we actually have some. Yeah, sure. Gift the enforcer some. Affirmative. All around. <laughs> Damage all his armor wherever we can. And you are the guy. Yeah, it's not a trebuchet. Structure is exposed, but we are still Back good. Back up through my armor, Commander. We are still kind of good, at least. Uh, the behemoth. Order. We would have bulwark if we just shoot from here. So if we go one, and uh, then see... Yes, just take him out. Copy that. Yes. Center torso hit. Mech destroyed. Pilot incapacitated. Glitchy! Good to go! Um, you have some firing... Not really good firing solutions, though. You move up here, you get one chevron, that's not a tree anymore, but... You will... Um, it's not in cover anymore, but you will have a decent shot at him. Which we are actually gonna increase even, and we are gonna see... Center torso is the best thing to hit right now. With everything, for 95%. Roger that. Firing on target! 
is unsteady, but we didn't go through the armor, unfortunately. Waiting for orders. And Lone Eagle, if you move to here, that's your hit chances. 55% only. Damn it. If you move to here, it stays the same. So, move to here. Coordinates for the received. flanking bonus thingy. I think we got a flanking shot here at least. No, it's still front. Oh well. Affirmative. Yeah, one salvo of the AC zone at least hit. That's the trebuchet who's moving, and he decides to fire at. Okay. My black chip. Look at the amount of rockets that thing has. I'm taking some serious hits. Yes, you do. It's not really surprising, to Commander? be honest. Uh, you can move over here. I mean, he still can hit me with indir indirect fire, but at least I'm in kind of cover here. Uh, which means... Yeah, 80, 80, 80, 35, loop. Got it. Lasers. It's the big laser, and there's the two small medium lasers. Ah, we hit the head and injured the pilot. Awesome. And the behemoth. Standing by. If you move up here, what kind of percentages will we get on the trebuchet? Let's see. Decent enough. Are not yet through the armor though. Not at I all. Hear ya. Glitch, uh, you can stay in position. And uh, how much percentage do we get? Not good enough for my taste, so... Center torso, please. Special delivery! Was that enough to go through the armor? Still not. I'm receiving you. Okay, uh, from here, if you would just fire, we get... what? 75%, okay, and if you would move over here, for example... 65%, okay. And if we move over here... 75%, but we would be in water. Ten four. I actually like that. We moved a little bit. And we will fire on the target. Structure is exposed. And we actually created one of his rocket Critical launchers. Critical hit, Commander. Awesome. Awesome. I think those are the last two guys actually from this launch, which was not a full launch, just three max. Although that panther hurts. He hurts pretty crazy. Uh good to go. Well, we could attack you with a melee attack. We're gonna try that. Uh yeah, small laser has an 80% hit chance. Punch! 70% damage, uh, 70 damage, and now the small laser, 20 on his leg. That was not a lot. Oh, he's running away. Bastard. Trying to hit the guy in the water. Well, actually, he hit the guy in the water. They're banging through my armor. Yeah, they're banging through your armor. Uh, for order. You're in reach for... Uh, you don't really have a small laser thingy though. Uh, how about if you just fire? On him, not really good. On him, pretty good. Yeah, go for it. Firing a full salvo. There goes one arm. He's unsteady. It's his turn though. How much rockets did you lose? You have one credit. Enough rockets lost. Uh, structure got exposed. Internal structure damage. Yeah. She like, she sounds a wee bit Scottish. Oh, you actually used your laser on a second shot. Damn it. Uh, you split your your fire. I mean. Okay. Uh, glitch. Waiting on you, commander. You don't really. Well, you kind of have targets. 
So if we go 75 and the other guy 80. Yeah, I'm gonna do a multi target here and here. And this one is going to be, and we're gonna fire. You get a headshot, and you get a headshot. Uh, not a headshot, but a decent hit. And he lost the basic for that. And a couple of rockets. Barely any damage there. Yes, Commander. Uh, you would you have a good shot here? Nope. Nope. So you're gonna move. How about you move over here? How is the shot there? Yeah, that's okay. I can live with that. I definitely can live with that. Um, sure. Give him the good news. Targeting for an alpha strike. Two recent hits and the laser hit as well. Makes him makes him unsteady again. Al sixty. Oh, that's an AC ten. Get him banged up pretty good. Yeah, you get him banged up pretty good. Uh, it's Cosmos turn. You are not in range for a nice attack here, uh, for a melee attack. You are in range to fire though. Actually, this one is even better. Yeah, this one is even better. So you fire upon him. Large numbers, yeah, that went all through. Took out the other arm. Pilot is injured. And he should have just some laser. Ah, no, he has another uh, rocket launcher here in the chest, I think. Maybe not. Good to go. Behemoth. Um. Okay, let me see your hit chances. 60 there, so, uh, not as much there. How about if you move, can you uh, melee attack somebody? No. If you move up here though, 60 and 60, 70. Yeah, uh, well, just move over here and then we decide where we shoot. Uh, who we shoot. Not where, who. We are gonna shoot. Either you 66, 70, 60, 60, or you same amount. But you have barely any armor left, so yeah, we're gonna fire on you first. On it. I was hoping to get through the armor. I did not. Glitch. What can I do for you? Ah, uh, that's all indirect fire. Indirect fire. That will be direct fire. Sure, move here then. I read you, Commander. Moving out. Because the indirect fire, your little rocket launcher is just not bringing enough punch there. That's a 60. Okay, we do dual strike. Your A, your your B. You're gonna go to B, and we're gonna fire. Uh huh. Central torso is gone. Has lost his AC-10. And there's more where that came the from. The pilot could injured as well. And now it's Lone Eagle's Wait turn. Uh, you could, well, you just move in here and see what we can do from the real front, just like this. Yeah, 65. It's not too great, but missed, missed, hit, hit. Lost all your evasion. It's your turn, you're gonna run away, kind of ish. Let's shoot this large la laser at my centurion. Which is okay ish, because the centurion's Waiting turn will be. Can you melee attack him? Oh, yes, you can. Run up and punch him in the chest. Yep, left arm and left torso destroyed. Pilot is incapacitated. Just getting started. Enemy down. It's the achievement we unlocked. It's getting hot in here. Good work, Commander. Mission, su Mission successful. I don't really want to triple shape, but the Commander would be a nice unit. Let's 
Seems like he has a decent amount of armor. <coughs> yep. He has a decent enough amount of armor of, of armor, I would say. Ugh. Finally finished that bottle of water. Disgusting. Um, the blackjack needs some repairs and the centurion needs some repairs. But otherwise we're good. Uh, of course, the cosmos needs to go to the hospital. Damn it. The enforcer. We already have one part, so we take two parts. Which brings us an enforcer. Yes, sir. We actually got the third part as well. <laughs> Some jump jets. I'm pretty good in jump jets, though. I have to say, I don't have a problem with jump, jet, jump jets right now. Uh-huh. And we wanted to see if we can rename the pilots or the mechs. That's the thing I'm gonna do right now. As soon as it's loaded and I don't forget again. Hopefully I won't forget again. Hopefully I won't forget again. Come on, load screen. I believe in you, because I have to actually get ready soon-ish. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we're gonna check that out, and then probably end the stream. We'll see. How long we would have to wait till anybody is back on. Is back Enforcer R4, 4R model. Awesome! So, first go to the barracks, Mac Warriors. Can we rename any of the Mac Warriors? Service records. I'm here. It doesn't look like it. We could dismiss them, but we can't do anything with them. Okay. We have three Mac Warriors up and ready. So if we, let me just check how long would it take? Uh, seven days. We have a financial report. In nine days, Medusa is back online. So we can wait nine days. Yeah. So there's no need to actually get another. Uh, to hire another mech warrior right now at least so if we go to the mech bay uh, Yeah, just repair which will take a day And you also just repair awesome Which will take it just a day very nice very very nice um, But we wanted to see if we could rename those guys so if we go to this one and... Oh, we can actually repaint them. Ah. Uh, this one would be scrap the Mac for sea bills, send the Mac to storage. It is an enforcer. We cannot rename him here anywhere. If we go into refit... Maybe we could? I'm definitely bringing this one out on the battlefield, actually, uh, by the way. AC-10, large laser. He looks okay-ish. Enforcer, fire support, skirmisher mech. Uh, oh, yeah, over here. Oh, no, never mind. I thought I could click on that, but I can't. I thought I could click on that to actually tell, uh, use it. That's just the tutorial, the Mac Bay overview, that's all good. Uh-huh. Nah, I can't I can't rename it. I saw this thing up here, I thought I maybe could click on it and rename it. Apparently I cannot. So that's a thing we cannot do, unfortunately. Let's check out the store again. Just to see. Yeah, we could buy a Griffin. Ooh, LRM20s. 
25 to crit chance and plus one to stability damage. Would be nice to get that stuff. But otherwise, nothing really super important. I mean, AC 20 plus would be nice. Well, we already have an AC 20 plus, but yeah. We have two months left money. It's not really a lot. Um, yeah. What kind of missions will we have? Let's just wait till at least uh, Medusa is back in action. Then we see what we can Ready get Ready to go over tasks. financials whenever you are. Current funds, that's okay. 800k, two more days, come on. We're nearly broke, Commander. Yeah, I know. One day... Awesome. So we would have four max ready to go again. If we look to co look up the contracts, we either travel for twenty three days, which is not a good decision, uh, because we need to make money now. So the next mission would be this one, a battle. Director of Battle Mac has been rampaging the restoration territory on Pansir. They've been raising population centers, burning fields and refineries, looting storage facilities. They're clearly doing everything they can think of to drive our people out of this territory. Ter terrorism. Now, this is terrorism, pure and simple. We need you to find them and destroy them. No escape and no prisoners. Yeah, we would do this one next and we would do it for all the cash. Because we are getting dangerously low on cash right now. Yeah, I think that would be the thing to do next. But I tell you what, guys, that's going to be it for this stream. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you watch it later in the videos, thank you for watching the videos. And uh, yeah, really hope to see you next time. Probably Saturday or Sunday. I have to do also. I also have to record a lot of other stuff like Hearts of Iron and um, also have to edit all those streams I just did. Yeah, I'm not quite sure when next episode, uh, when the next stream will be. Probably soon, though, because I can't leave my fingers from this game. I really enjoy it. So one more time, thanks for watching. Hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.